Yeah, I love Sound City. Well, I was involved in uh, setting Sound City up back in 2008. Um, it was around from the, uh, my old office for the first two years. A uh, company around called Merseyside Acme. Um, I set it up in Capital Culture here because uh, I thought Capital Culture really wasn't showing enough about how strong the Liverpool music scene was. So set up Sound City. Uh, brought Dave in to run it, and then uh, it's gone from strength. You know, all credit to Dave. I haven't been, I haven't been involved since the early days, really, but uh, it's brilliant. British music is obviously the world lead. You know, something like seven out of ten albums that were bought last year were made by, you know, were produced by British artists. So it shows it's it's where you know rock and roll was born between you know, UK and the USA. And things. But I've always preferred British music to be honest from punk days and um, but I think when you look at Britain I think you've still got to look at there's very clear differences and I think Liverpool's you know obviously I'm biased but I think there's always something special about Liverpool and Liverpool bands from you know from from the Beatles onwards and it's I think it's true now and I think looking around Sound City I think one of the strong points again and back to the early days is how much great local young talent to showcase and you know it's just it's just uh, best and out at the moment, like loads of great young bands, loads of great venues. I took a band to America back when I, I was a sort of a manager, but didn't have a clue what I was doing, and I did everything wrong, probably. So, uh, I, so I can probably, it's, it's probably, it's probably, probably, I think, speak to people who've done it. You know, there's loads of good people around Liverpool who've, who've toured internationally, managers and bands, and speak. So, I always find people who've done it who can talk you through the pitfalls. That's that's an easy one, and then. Really boring stuff like work out your budgets properly and all yeah. that, and work out you know visas and what you need and and um, and again it's a bit boring, but like it's a, remember it's a job you know you're going away with your mates so have, have a laugh and you're playing you know you do what you love you're playing music, but while you're there you're showcasing yourself and you know you're trying to further your career so you know work hard before you pass you really like, and then and then you know you it's things like South by Southwest you know if you're going there. Everybody's there. You've got to like. You've got to be on your game. You've got to be really at it, and then you can then you can party and have a good time as well. You can do both.